In this video, we will uh, uh, learn how to uh, create an app with uh, tabs. So, we create a new canvas app. App underscore tabs, create. Then on screen, on visible, we will write the code to create the collection for the tab elements or the, uh, the tab text. So here uh, we have a tab, the collection tab, which has two uh, columns, two fields, the ID and the name. So there are four tabs. Uh, here we will save it. <clears throat> um, we will try to run it once. So that will uh, create the tabs. Now we will insert a gallery. gallery blank horizontal we will assign this collection as the data source <coughs> we'll add the button we'll reduce the size of the gallery we'll move it a little bit at the top we make the button little bigger so it looks like tabs then we take this okay now this button text we set to uh, this item dot uh, this item dot name text this item dot name that's better okay <coughs> Now we will insert uh, four containers for the four tabs. So we will go to the gallery, screen, insert, input, container. Container one, let's leave some space here. And We'll put a label. <coughs> oh, okay. This is container one, and We can similarly insert other control, other controls like text input and you know drop down combo box we'll try to put some controls. This is uh, home screen home tab home page. Okay. We create a copy of this copy and then we paste we paste 
paste. One, two, three, four. Okay. So we rename it to two. We name this to three. We rename this to four. <coughs> Now for container one uh, label, this is home page. <coughs> for container two label, this is products page. For container three label, this is coming soon page. Container four label, this is contact us page okay now for the button on select so gallery button uh, on select on 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 uh, on select we will set the variable current tab current tab as this item dot id and container one container one should be visible only when the current tab is equal to one container two should be visible container two should be visible only when the current visible only when the current tab is 2 container 3 should be visible only when the current tab is 3 container 4 should be visible when the current tab is 4 so now <coughs> we run it for home this is home page products products page coming soon and contact us so you can also on visible you can set it to uh, screen on visible <coughs> you can set it to one set current tab to one And then we run it so it's the this home page of course when you run it because this is preview so it will not set it to one so this is how you do a tab control uh, basically the logic is you put a horizontal gallery uh, then uh, create the tab on the screen on select on visible you create the uh, collection you assign it to this gallery in the gallery there is a button on button click you set the current tab to this item dot id and the container is visible when the current tab is the same id as the clicked button of that gallery <coughs>